Hey, what's up guys? This is Kevin Silva from Social Media Money Masters and in this video, I want to show you how to share a YouTube video on Facebook. Uh, now, if you want to share a YouTube video on Facebook, you know, you could do it a couple of ways. Uh, one way is you can manually go take the link and go and post that link, uh, share that link on uh, Facebook. So I'll show you how to do that. Uh, the best way, the fastest way to do that. There's also other ways. The second way is to simply, uh, you know, go to YouTube and click the share button, you know, share on Facebook button. But the third way is one that I'm going to be sharing with you. And this is what we teach people when it comes to creating your syndication. Okay. Now to create a syndication, uh, what we do is we want to set up a syndicate, which means everything happens on autopilot. So I'll be showing you, uh, uh, the last thing I'll be showing you is how to uh, make some changes in your YouTube account so that every time you hit the thumbs up on a video, it's instantly, the video itself will show up inside of your Facebook newsfeed and be shown to all your friends. If you upload a video, it's instantly shared on Facebook. Uh, so it happens on autopilot. So let's get started. So the first way, uh, we can do this is we can come over to YouTube. There was me watching that uh, seniors uh, video. Actually, you know what? Let's use that as the example. So let's say I wanted to share this video, uh, which was, you know, it was seen by so far 8.4 million people. It was really funny. Uh, you know, you got this old man here, you know, doing like monkey noises and stuff, and they don't realize they're being recorded. So it's funny. Uh, you always want to share funny stuff with your friends on Facebook, right? Uh, in other, you know, there's a saying, uh, "Funny is money." Uh, funny is money. Uh, you know, whether you're a marketer, whether you're, uh, you know, it doesn't matter what market you're in, or if you're going after customers, clients, prospects, or friends. Funny is going to be uh, something that across the board will work. So we could simply just take the link, right? Come up here to the address bar, copy the link, come back here to Facebook, and then I can come over here, and then what's in your mind? I can just paste in the link, okay, and boom, it pulls in that YouTube video. Now it pulls in the thumbnail, pulls in the title, description. Now here's the deal. Um, a lot of people don't know this, but you can actually change the title, okay? You could double click it, and uh, we could put like, you know, funny video, of elderly people, you know, elderly people, you know, I mean, you could do whatever you want, all right? Uh, you could change it to where, you know, you talk directly to your friends. Uh, you could change the description. Then, once you've uh, added that link and it's the video shows up, you could just take that link out and now put, you know, here is an awesome video, okay? Here's an awesome video that had me on the floor laughing, okay? Something like that. And you just post it and it's as simple as that now the second option we talked about was by clicking the uh share on facebook right so if we come over here to share you'll see right here there's a facebook twitter and plus one button okay so if we want to share it on google plus boom click that if we want to share it on twitter click there if we want to share it on facebook click that button so that's how we can share it uh, and if we click on share to facebook we'll get this pop-up now on the pop-up, um, you know, we could come over here and we can, again, type whatever we want. We could double click, change the title, change the description, same thing, okay? So now, uh, those are the two ways we could do it. Either uh, we can go grab the link, go share the link. Number two, we can do it right from here, uh, get the pop-up and do it right from YouTube. The third option, setting up your syndicate which is really important, this is a huge part of the Social Media Money Master system, uh, is creating your syndicate. So if we come over to our account, we go to the settings section, okay, settings. Then once you're in the settings section, you come over here to the sharing section, okay, sharing. Now here you can see that you have your Facebook, Twitter, uh, Google Reader, Google Buzz, now you can see over here the orcot is not connected so that's what all of yours are going to look like now all you want to do is simply be logged in to the facebook account you want to synchronize with your youtube okay so you have another tab open on your browser be signed into facebook uh, and as long as you're signed in on that tab once you come over here you click on the connect it'll already know it'll go after that account that you're already logged into in another tab um, and you want to do the same thing if you so choose with Twitter and so on. Now, there's a couple of options here. 
So I think by default, I, I forget which ones are going to be selected, but these are the three that I have chosen. When I like a video, when I upload a video, or when I add a video to a playlist. Uh, you know, when I comment a video, do I really want every single one of my friends to see that I commented on a video? Not really. Uh, do I want all my friends to know when I subscribe to a YouTube channel? Maybe, uh, but not on this account. See, me, uh, obviously, you guys know I'm a marketer, right? I, I do social media marketing. Uh, now, that doesn't, you know, a lot of people would take that the wrong way, but social media to me is provide value, massive value. Then you provide them even more value on a webinar, and then you make an offer at maybe at the end of the webinar. That's it, right? So even when you're going to offer something, you do it after providing massive value. That's pretty much our whole thing. But, you know, obviously, I'm trying to build my audience, build a following. So all I'm really, to looking, uh, all I'm really looking to share with my audience is when I like a video. So let's say I don't feel like creating my own content today. Well, I'll just simply go to YouTube, like somebody else's video that's, you know, like this one, funny, or simply, uh, you know, maybe it's something that's related to my topic. You know, if, if I talk about social media all the time, I know all my friends are interested in social media. I could find somebody else's uh, uh, video that's really valuable about social media and just go over there and click the thumbs up. Okay, and if you don't know what I mean, uh, let's take this video. So if I come over here to this video, all right, if I come over here to this video, See this little uh, thumbs up down here, the like or you know dislike. So if I click the like button, okay, it's going to now, uh, you know, within a few minutes, it'll actually show up inside of Facebook uh, as me sharing it. So if I re re refresh this page, um, okay, so right there, see right here. So here you can see the name of the video. You can see the actual video is there. Uh, you could see, you know, but I wasn't able to edit it. I wasn't able to add my own comment. Uh, another thing is, if you are a marketer or if you have an audience that, uh, you know, you're trying to build, you know, some type of, uh, of bond with, right, by sharing value with them, uh, this wouldn't be the way you want to go. And the reason is, uh, if you're looking for your stuff, to, your videos to go viral, I'm saying, what you want to do is you want to use one of the other options simply because, uh, when you do this option by just simply clicking the thumbs up, you see how it doesn't have the share, all right? Not having the share link there is huge because people can't share that with their friends. You want them to share your video. You don't want them to have to go to YouTube, find the link, and then share it themselves. You want them to share your stuff because you want your stuff to go viral, right? Um, however, if it's just something that's funny that you wanted to share with your friends, that's fine. Just share it. Uh, make sure if it's something that you want your friends to see, just click the like button. All right. Like it yourself. Uh, you know, Facebook has made the changes recently where the only thing that we see uh, that shows up in this area is the top stories. OK. And a top story, you know, coming from Facebook themselves is something uh, that has been liked or people are commenting on. The majority of stuff goes without a single like. So by simply liking it yourself, all right, just liking your own comment or, or post, uh, just that one like will put you ahead of 99.9% .9 of the stuff that gets put out there, all right? So that's going to help you get over there. And just by, you know, hitting the like button, that gets it more people will see it, more people will like and comment and so on. So coming back to YouTube, uh, if, if we go back, so we can, again, like it upload and add a video to a playlist so the way the reason i like this is because us as social media marketers uh you know we're gonna put out stuff as social media you can either upload your own stuff so if you upload a video it's instantly gonna be shared just like that one was now remember by using the synchronized one it will show up without that share link okay that's something you want to keep in mind However, uh, what you can do and what I like to do is I'll upload the video to YouTube so that as soon as the video is uploaded to YouTube, it's instantly going to be shared on Facebook instantly. Now, it doesn't have the share link, but that's okay with me. Why? Because I'll then take the video and go embed it into a blog post. And then the blog post will be shared uh, again using the syndication. In another video, I show you how to uh, you know, connect your RSS feed to Facebook the same way so that as soon as you create a blog post, boom. It's instantly shared with your audiences on Facebook, Twitter. Uh, now, if you're just a regular person, maybe you don't, you know, you know, you don't really get the whole audiences things. That's fine. Uh, if you just have friends you want to share stuff with, this is plenty. Okay, just liking it will be fine. Uh, uploading at if you add a video to a playlist, 
same thing. All right, guys. So that's it for this video. That's how you can post your YouTube videos or other people's YouTube videos to your Facebook account. Uh, and just to recap, the first one we went over is simply grabbing the link to the video. Uh, you can come over here to the share to get the link, or you can just grab the link that's in the uh, you know address bar. Come over to YouTube, uh, Facebook, and then uh, once on Facebook, you can just come over to your profile or wherever you know from wherever you can do a status update. Go to uh, what's on your mind, paste in the link, and it'll automatically pull it in. So that's number one. Number two is uh, you can go to the share button. So you click on share. All right, and then you'll get this little pop-up. You can click on the share to Facebook. You'll get that pop-up where you can edit the title, description, and also leave a comment with the video. And then the third one is you can just sync up your YouTube account so it all happens on autopilot. Now, I was just thinking of something. Uh, there's actually, I believe, another way that you could do this, but um, it's escaping my mind. I just had it, but I'll just create another video. I'll probably create a, a part two to this video. Uh, and I'll throw it up on uh, socialmediamoneymasters.com. Socialmediamoneymasters.com uh, is a blog where I'll be throwing this video. And I'll create a part two. Uh, it's, I'm just trying to come up with that. I just had it in my mind, but it's not coming to me. Uh, but those are three. Oh, okay. Here it is. I just thought of it. So what I wanted to explain to you is that if you grab this video, just so you know, um, I don't know where you would use this, but if you leave a comment now, uh, you, uh, Facebook has actually made it to where if you put the link uh, in a comment, when you post that comment on somebody else's post on Facebook, when you leave a comment, if you put the link to a YouTube video inside of that comment and then you publish that comment, what will happen is that uh, video will actually show up inside the comments. Okay, so not only can you post comments uh, to a as a as a original post but you can actually embed a youtube video into uh the comments of a post all right i'm trying to find an example but it's not showing up but i knew i'd come up with it that there it is uh so that's it guys that's it for this video i hope you got some value out of it uh and if, again if you want more videos like this go to socialmediamoneymasters.com and you'll find plenty make sure you leave us your feedback and let us know what you think see you on the next video